So, uh, so and just keep an eye on this, this will tell us when it's streaming. Yep. Um, and when I'm fishing, you can probably just sit in this seat here, you can plug this in and just keep the charge up to it. Yeah, uh, it's only a short cable. I had a long cable that would reach it, but um, it's, uh, it wasn't going to reach it. So I'll leave that here. So that's basically just from the Yep, from there, and that's telling us there that we've got uh, this many people here watching. We've got none at the moment, but we might have 20 or 30 during the day. Yep. And then that tells you how long the stream's for. If it gets interrupted, you let me know, because what happens is if it loses signal, it'll drop out and come back and drop out and come back into that one window. So, yeah, right so we're sweet with that. That's in a water sort of case as well, so. Yeah, yeah well, as soon as you can go and fish, I'll sit there. Yeah, you can just sit there and uh, keep it, just keep it. If I see it's not working, I'll just yell Yeah, yeah, that's right, look, there's not, you know, it's not, we, we sort of got it up and going a few times again yesterday. Yeah. I've just got to get my, get my PFD. There, got me seal skin socks in case it gets nasty. All right, thongs there. This can go over that. And we are going fishing for the day. Post a link. Like my waterproof case? Yeah, that's the job. That's what our live stream looks like yep. at the moment. So I'm just going to share that. Copy link. up there, the links are there, I think we're streaming, we're all good. So where are you from? Uh, Lake McClory. Lake Mac? Yeah. Super. This one in here, Sydney. Big grand final here last year, wasn't it? Yeah, it was good. Seems like we had epic sessions on that bridge. Yeah, very lucky, it's not like that all the time. No, no, they were spawning then. I think they were all just loading up there the whole time. I was out there on Saturday and 
Jamie McEwen was there as well. Oh yeah, he said he dropped in on the way down. Yeah. going to start up the end at Palm Beach, so just up the other end of Pitwater we're going to start. Hopefully I can catch a nice limit there and then we're going to go top ordering for the rest of the day up in uh, Cowan Creek, that's the plan. Yep. So catch a limit first and then do the fun stuff. Last year I did it the very first order, I tried to do the fun stuff first then catch a limit, I was a bit, a bit nervous doing that. Yeah. All those rods are tied down, yes. Fishing, huh?
take it slow and just going up here. on the spot from last year too. Bastard. Oh well, that's why you don't publish your uh, spots in the open. <laughs> yeah, true. Isn't this also known as a car park? Uh, all this is up here, yeah. Anyway, let's get going, eh? Yep. Bit of a rough ride there, all the rods are tangled up. Is there a screen supposed to come off in this thing? No, 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 it, it doesn't show you all the screens while it's streaming. If it just says that if the number's clicking over, yep. it's all good. So yes, a wild and woolly start that was. <sighs> the fish.
good head shake on him. Not huge, but that'll do for a start. Is that a 30 centimeter? Do you want to move that? Just move that back a little bit. Yep. Sweet. All right. Was that first cast? Second cast. Second cast. We like it. So pull my phone down from there. I'll show you how we use the track my fish stuff. Uh, so this is the code to unlock it. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, I'll forget that part. Yeah, it's alright. <laughs> You'll know it by the end. Yeah. And there's an right. app. So there's an app, which is here. Yep. And all we do is pick the. Okay, so take a photo. Oh, let me just measure it first. That is uh, 31 and a half. So hold it up that way. That way yep, just. Okay, then you go to here, and you say, yep, that photo's good. And then it's yellowfin brim. That's all right, we already picked that. Length. Length, yeah, so length. It's in millimetres to the fork, 315. And then hit submit, that's it. Catch another one. <sighs> Two casts, one fish, I like that. Three casts, two fish. Oh, that's a better one. Oh, it just came out. <laughs> Through the hooks. <laughs> uh, it was way on the other side of that boat too. Yeah, it was. <laughs> he actually bent one of the hooks out a bit there on the crab. Organised. He only came here and threw one cast in the practice and got a 37, so. <laughs> Obviously, there's a school under there here, that only about halfway down to the bottom. Come on, nice quick limit, and we're going to go top watering for the day. There's another one. Yeah, 
another giant, but we'll take them. Already that first fish was the same as my biggest one yesterday. <laughs> Little fella. Still, we'll take him. Number two, it's not a cranky crab. I fish a stick minnow on these boats, except the. Um... All right. Yep. Super. That'll give you a link. The length is 28 and a half, I think on the little side. 285, yep. That'll be all right. right. My fish tried to submit the catch, but was unsuccessful. The catch has been stored. On ah, that's right. Okay. Yep. Ah, oh, because it's is it on offline mode. Oh. There you go. Well That'll go now. Gonna retie that because it's got a little nick in the line. That's good. There's a good start. Should have started here last year. Didn't come here till nearly lunchtime last year. What's that look? A big flat over there, is it? Yeah, it's big flat all the way to the end, to that big wow. mountain over there. It's called the car park. Yeah. It should fish pretty good today, too. Yeah, no sun, bit of wind. But I don't like to fish in the car park. It's a bit boring. I like throwing out stuff, so. Yeah. So that's more, this is more me. So that was a pretty wild start. Uh, welcome to the live stream. We've got some viewers uh, for the second day Australian Open on the Hawkesbury. It is nasty, nasty weather. Showers, windy, but the fish are biting and that's what we're here for. So had about four casts so far and hooked three and landed two. So we like the start. Good thing about these boats is you leave them for half an hour and they, they recharge. Yeah. I saw Daniel Bonacorso was here before, I don't know where he went. He was in the Quintrex. He's magically disappeared. I'm not complaining. <laughs> because that pontoon there... Yeah, he got one off the barge. That's, that's when I got all my fish off last year, that barge basically. This blue boat out here was the one I got on practice. I threw one cast at it, got a big one, so. And about 15 of his mates came up with it. Let's see that. Let's see how that goes.
I'm gonna do something smart. I'm gonna pick up the five pound, not the three pound. So I know it lives under this one. Daniel's magically disappeared. Maybe he left while we were catching fish. This is an eight foot six crab rod, this. Gives you a little bit of cushioning for them so they don't bend the hooks out as much, you know. Straight through fluorocarbon, five pound and an eight foot six rod. Like yeah, no worries. It doesn't affect casting? No. Ah, oh, crabs are pretty heavy anyway. It's like yeah. casting a golf ball. And you use the heavy crabs, right? Uh, yeah, I always use the heavy crabs, so... Better on the Yeah. Oh, I just... That's about the speed I reckon a panicking crab sort of swims away, you know, yeah. so... This lazy little boat out here. Ooh. So this is a spot called Palm Beach. It's near uh here, Alf Stewart's flaming mongrel shack. <laughs> Which is just down the front here. Rightio, that's the money cast. Look at all the crud under that boat. There's a fish, I can feel him eating it. Shaking his head. You want to come in? Oh, he's a good one. He's a real good one. That's a real nice one. Come on, old mate. Come for a ride in the live well. Like, the longer in the water, the more they're chewing up those little hooks. Look at that thing. Look at me, mate. Oh, look at me. <laughs> Check that thing out. Wow. Dinosaur. <laughs> That's massive. <laughs> oh, let's get another one. See, five pound. Look at this thing. <laughs> and got one little tiny hook there. I oh, know he had the other side in him too, so. Let's just 
Get him out. That is a dinosaur. It's probably a kilo, that one. Take a photo right through the thing, yep. Yep. Got it. Got it, yep. So that one there, there he is. Let's measure him up. 375. Three. You can go on the big side. Three seventy-five. All right, I can go there. That's a kicker. That's a kicker. That's one kicker. We want them all that size, so they got some ground to make up. Well, I'm glad I picked up the five-pound rod too, eh? Yeah. <laughs> that nice big long rod it just buffers that you know he was sitting down there shaking his head when I'm in the pre-fish I caught one that size and there was 15 same size with him yeah so hopefully they'll There's one of his mates come on old bean come out of there Just says he doesn't even know he's hooked this one yet. Back the drag off a little. Come on, mate. Stay in there, cranker hooks. Look at him just sitting down deep, shaking his head. Oh! That's why he doesn't know he's hooked yet. It's a friggin' leather jacket in the tail. That's why it felt like it was shaking his head. <laughs> I've never caught one of those ones before. That felt just like a massive brim. <laughs> the head shakes was the tail going side to side. He's got, look at the spikes on his tail. Yeah. Never caught one of those before. There's a few of them at the bridge on Saturday. Really? I was getting excited then, I thought there was another big one. Yeah. Still good. Last year I couldn't catch them on crabs, on these boats. It was too fine and calm, they didn't want it. They wanted stick your nose, but... Crab day today. How was that not a big brim? <laughs> we'll just rest this boat for a little bit. We're going to go over and we'll do the pontoon now. That's been rested since Daniel's caught one on it. I seriously didn't see Daniel go. Just to clear things up, I'm cool that he started there. If I wanted to be there first, I should have caught more fish yesterday. <laughs> no one owns any spots on this dig. Nah. You get there first, good on you. How's the live stream going? She's up. Yep. 36 minutes in. Nice. So we've got what, we've got a 37, a 31 and a 28 or something, wasn't it? And the, and the rain's stopping, it's going to be a great day. Yeah, it's a big day. Yep. Don't believe all those girls wanted to curl it off this morning. Yeah. <laughs> They're all saying, oh, we're going to go. It's like, yeah. Oh, me too. The whole way here. We stayed at Narrabeen and it's on the beach, so you get an epic amount of wind there.
Alrighty. This was Epic Pat Pontoon from last year. Oh, the wind took that line. That's the only thing about the heavy line. That's the money cast. in the weed that one. Seems like the fish are all sitting on these front boats. Let's give them another go. So we hooked two on that one, one on that one, none on that one, one on that one. Okay, so it looks like it's going there. I'm going to hit the record. Oh, you on now? Yep. Nah. Oh, now it's on again. Testing one two, test one two, one two, one two. One two, one two. One. One two. Can't even see that. Test. Yep, good test. We should have audio.
She's good. So hopefully I've got audio now. Just going to double check to make sure that this isn't sitting on uh, on mute. <coughs> Wasting all my fishing time trying to get this thing going, but audio one too. Yep, should have audio there. The camera decides to turn its own audio off all the time, which is painful. <laughs> So update if, uh, if you're just watching the live stream, we got uh, three in the well, a 37, a 31 and a 
26 or something like that. 28. 28. So that's a good start, we like that. This time last year I was scratching my head up the river there, working out what was going on. Just gonna have four or five casts of this stick minnow on these little broken patches here. So I like these little broken patches on this point. I'm gonna give these boats a rest. We gotta hit a couple more boats, maybe up in Kareel Bay. We're definitely going to go up and uh, fish Cowing Creek with top waters, which we won't be able to live stream because it's uh, out of reception. But we will record and do the highlights tonight. So let's see how she goes. A couple more throws on this stuff. That's weed. It's a good old weed bite. So this stick minnow, you've got to sink it down until it just sort of touches the top of the weed but doesn't sink into it. And then whipping it. Last cast and we're moving. Island there. Should be wild and woolly out there. Alright, let's get out of here. Let us get out of here. Hopefully I don't have to spend too much more time mucking around with that live stream today. Alright. So do you want to throw that in here? Yep. That'll get it out of the road. Ah, I'll give you a PFD too. Try that one. happens in today that's only like uh, 20 kilometers an hour. <laughs> 
top anyway. Uh, I could go fast over this, but it just beats everything. coming. What time did that go? Uh, a Pantera Classic. Oh yeah. Two people have ordered some of them now. Mm. How long did you get that? Uh, about a month I think. 